Hi, welcome to the tutorial Map Energy Part 1. In this tutorial, we'll be learning how to quickly and easily collect and display the energy data for a module using Map. In order to collect the energy data, we'll add the MP Energy Core configuration. This is where we find the map link, which uniquely identifies the map component within the map environment. The map link establishes the connection between programming and configuration. For example, the configuration specifies how the export files with the current energy consumption are to be named. The next step is to add the function block MP Energy Core. It collects all the energy data and calculates the energy consumption. Using input MP link, we establish a connection to the configuration we created earlier, named G Energy Core. The function block is enabled using input enable. In order to save the energy data, a data storage device must be defined. This was previously defined in the hardware configuration and called HD. In the next step, function block MP Energy Reg Energy is added. This collects the energy data of a module. Via the MP Link input, we'll connect the same map link used for MP Energy Core. The function block is enabled using input Enable. The name of the module that provides the energy data is defined using input Module Name. We'll use the name My Module. Mode defines how the register data is to be used. We'll use the mode MP Energy Reg Mode Collect. More information about the mode can be found in Automation Help. Units determines the unit used to specify the energy data. We'll use the unit MP Energy Energy Unit KWH. This means that the energy data is specified in kilowatt hours. Finally, variables are created which are used to specify the absorbed and emitted active energy to MP Energy Reg Energy. MP Energy Core collects the provided data of all registered modules and calculates the energy consumption. After the changes are downloaded, the program can be tested. Monitor mode is enabled. The variables and function blocks were added to the watch window. The values that are displayed for the absorbed and emitted active energy come directly from the module used. The current energy consumption is indicated on the output parameters of MP Energy Core. The collected energy data can be exported as a CSV file using the command export. The file was stored on the specified data storage device. When we open the file, we can see the module's energy consumption data. As you can see, it's very easy to calculate a module's energy consumption data using MAP. Thanks for watching.